Hello, I am Felix, and today I will be explaining Wiesner's hypothesis of continental drifting. Our learning target for today will be I can be able to explain Wiesner's hypothesis of continental drifting. Now you may ask, what is Wiesner's hypothesis of continental drifting? Well, Wiesner stated that 300 million years ago, the continents had been joined into a single landmass he called Pangaea, which means all Earth in Greek. The supercontinent then broke apart, and the continents have been drifting into their current positions ever since. Wiesner called his hypothesis continental drift. Now, in order to begin part two of this tutorial, we must first review the phrases fit of continents, fossil, paleoclimate, and geologic formation. Now you may ask, what is fit of continents? Fit of continents are continents that fit together like puzzle pieces. Today in this video, we will be representing the continents with this dirt Minecraft block. The next phrase is fossil. A fossil is the remains or impression of a prehistoric organism preserved in petrified form or as a mold or cast in rock. Today, we will be representing fossils with the white block. The next phrase we need to understand is paleoclimate. A paleoclimate is a climate prevalent at a particular time in geologic history. Today, we will be representing paleoclimates and plant fossils with the white stick. The last phrase we must understand is geologic formation. A geologic formation is a formation that is distinctive enough in appearance that a geological mapper can tell it apart from the surrounding rock layers. Now an explanation. Wiesner reasoned that the continents of Africa and South America fit together like puzzle pieces, which is shown on this blocky representation. Wiesner also showed evidence that the same fossils of prehistoric animals were found on the two continents. I represent that here with the white blocks. Wiesner also figured out that the same fossils of plant species were found on each continent, showing that South America and Africa had the same paleoclimate during the same phases of history, which is represented with the white sticks. Two other continents, North America and Europe, had the same aged geologic formations, such as the Appalachians being the same age of that of the Scottish Highlands and the mountains in Norway. Now, geologic formations form at the same time if they're the same age and made out of the same rock type. Using all this information, Wiesner proposed that all the continents had originally been joined in one big supercontinent he called Pangaea, which later broke apart in the process he called continental drift, as I explained earlier in the video. Now some questions I'm going to ask for review is, what is a fossil? You have 10 seconds to answer. A fossil is the remains of a prehistoric organism. The next question is, what does Pangaea mean? Again, you have 10 seconds to answer. Pangaea means all Earth. What is fit of continents? Again, you have 10 seconds to answer. Fit of continents is continents that fit together like puzzle pieces. Today I talked about Wiesner's hypothesis of continental drift, the phrases fit of continents, fossil, 
paleoclimate and geologic formation. I also talked about how Wiesner applied his research and provided questions to answer at the end for review. Resources are in the description. Please like and subscribe.